Man, bro. You know how certain things go from, like, just saying enough is enough, you know, it's just turning into an embarrassment. Uh-huh. And I really want to set the record straight. Like, I'm I'm saying what I'm saying, and I'm still giving props to, like, we got to stop women out here proposing. You know mm. what I'm saying? Big-ass stop sign. I said it. All red, white letters. Stop. S-T-O-P. We got to stop doing it. It's turning into an embarrassment, but that's what I'm saying. Like, you don't want shit to intend that way, so we just got to stop it all all the way around. You know what I'm saying? Now, before I even get a disclaimer on the reason why, if any women out here, you choose to do that shit, that's you. Be a trendsetter. I ain't trying to be, be like, you feel me? That's you. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Set the trend. I ain't, even, I ain't mad at you. You know, but when it comes to an embarrassment where... The kings ain't even responding like, you know, I, I guess it would be yes, uh-huh. I do, or, you know, whatever, a form of, you know what I'm saying, yeah, we going to do this. But these niggas is telling you to get up and, you know what I'm saying, turn the music back on. And I'll show you a clip, OTC, off, off okay. the art, you know what I'm saying, OTA. But other than that, I'm going to read y'all the scripture, you know what I'm saying, where... I had just had to tune in to like, you know, different proverbs. Okay. Of the Bible, New Testament, King James, all of that. Okay. If y'all went to church and you tuned in, you familiar with the language. I wasn't speaking for him. Okay. You know what I'm saying? But the reason why I say we just gotta stop is because Proverbs eighteen twenty two, the new international version, it says, He who finds a wife finds what is good and okay. receives favor. From the Lord. Mm. I ain't want to play with it, so I had to read it. I put up my phone. We've been doing good, keeping our shit with the, with the boy. You know, excuse the language, but yeah. he who finds a wife finds what is good and receives favor from the Lord. That's right. I'm going I'm to spit one more, and this is the same verse. Same but verse. But it's, it's differently said. <laughs> the man who finds a wife finds a treasure and receives favor from the Lord. Mm. When a man finds a wife, he finds something good. It shows that the Lord is pleased with him. Exactly. So basically, as a man, as a woman, we know all you know did to seek and find puzzles. We need to seek and find words, put them together, circle them, cross them out. We mm. got that. So you got to allow the man to do that. If you want to be got or you know you want to be married or you want to even take that step, you got to let that you got to let them do that. You can't. And that's why I said like shout out to all the the queens out here that's been trans I do y'all, you know what I'm saying, but we shouldn't be you know quadrupling the trend setting of doing it. Like focus in on 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 the on the right way versus they way. Or yeah. what they did, basically. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people, they trying it. You know what I'm saying? But I did see an embarrassing moment. Like I said, my man straight said, turn the music back on. So I was like, yeah, we got we got to talk about that. For yeah. Real. Um, He'll drop a clip. Y'all going to have to let us know. Uh-oh. And, and when I first pledged KSI, shout out to the noobs. Okay. Beta Noob, Big Money Boxing Beta Noob. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Oh, that talk, George. 2K6. But uh, <laughs> KS Conviction in this house. Okay. But, uh, man, we was in Pretty Willy, Pretty Willy video, bro. We was in in the ceremony like he was getting married. Ill Mac was in that thing. Did the... Ill, man, y'all could Google it. Ill might throw the clip up or whatever. I ain't talking no, no, no cap. This is all facts, but... He said it in there, like I find it the good thing. Like that's the name of the of the uh the song or whatnot. And that's that's a joint right there for real. If y'all don't know, that's that's a bang. Y'all might want to <laughs> play that. Cause I know they taking notes, but if you want to listen to some 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 gems or somebody singing some melodies to y'all, there you go. But we gotta stop the uh getting on the one knee. Nah, bro. Okay. No. Uh we gotta stop that. 
And that's why if I said. Man, if a man want to marry you, he going he gonna to do it, queen. I want to start there. You feel me? Never would I look, um, look that Carrie and think she'd be hit telling Elmet on one knee. Nigga, yeah, please. I mean, it's not a good thing. But you they, know what I'm saying? They're trendsetting it, you know. I mean, they trendsetting it because it's, uh, I mean, they might really be in love. Like, these women might really be in love. You know what I'm saying? It's they might really be in love. They might really want to marry these men, but you have to wait until this man is ready. It's challenging. That's all it is. And, but but I, I guess what I'm saying, too, is we all know, and real niggas know, all women don't have patience. They don't. So I guarantee if you ask a married woman now, she'll tell you she had to have a lot of patience to even allow her man to do that, bro. But she didn't go do the opposite of what was done to her. She it, it, it evolved into it happened. But she had enough patience to not do that, though. You know what I'm saying? Get on one knee. And they still tell you, yeah, I don't have patience, but I had a lot of patience for me not to be the what the modern shit going on with the the women doing that. You know, man, um, this is the thing, right? Women tend to do things even if they don't feel a certain way or even if shit is going wrong. You know what I'm saying? Like mm-hmm. women can get in a heated argument thirty eight huh? and still go to a wedding the same day. Like ain't nothing happen. And be all up on you. And be all in your face. And act like y'all got the best relationship. I don't know what that is about women. Men uh, not like that. Like if you gonna curse us out before a wedding. If you gonna ask us is we going. We gonna say no nah, we ain't going. I'm good. Just cancel the whole shebang. And don't bring that in. Cancel everything. To the wedding. Yeah. For sure. But women have the ability to do that. I don't know why they would want to do that. But a lot of women be out here like in messed up situations, but want to portray themselves as okay. Now, I, now with my with my queen being the way she is, she ain't not that much of a people person. I real shit, we done did that, and she the flat out told me I don't want to go. So it's like, yeah, you gotta know. Yeah, that's that's the reality. I mean, that's that would be the better thing to do. Don't go. Cause yeah, because you, you bring it just like going you bring to a work, negative energy to you bring it somebody win because you could and don't get it wrong or get it twisted. You can get shit figured out, then go, but don't go as if like we we ain't good. Oh, we nah. gonna spend some hours up in the spot like we good, and we gonna leave knowing we wasn't we wasn't never good coming in the entry. Exactly. All right, don't do that. Yeah. So, yeah. but that's how they do though. Nah, men be right though. And my mama, y'all better yeah. tune in. And that's the thing. You have to allow that man to come to you because it might be some issues that you might have that he might not even be vocally saying to you that he might be waiting for you to either grow out of or see if you can change. Because I know, nigga, wifey hit me with the ultimatum. Straight. Nigga. No BLT. She hit me with some shit like, I'm not going into so-and-so and so-and-so without being married. Oh. You feel me? Okay. And I, I think, said, and you know what I said? Uh-huh. We might as well go and break up now. Man, I had. Because, I, like, that's not going to make a man want you. That's not going to make a man want to get married. I wouldn't get married because yeah. we still had some issues to work out before we got married. I wanted to get married 100%. If we ain't married 100%, trust got to be 100. Love got to be, everything got to be on the 100. Because once you get married, that's biblical shit. The right. devil, devil going to step in. For sure. Shit going to happen. Life going to happen. I think we all had the moments where you you rocking with a chick, she will give you that ultimatum. But it's just it's just as simple as that. Like it wasn't nothing really extra, right? But proposing to me is the ultimate ultimatum. Mm-hmm. That's to the and extreme. men don't like ultimatums anyway. That's, that's to the extreme. Yeah. yeah, that just you ain't gonna get no positive reception from that. That's and I believe that's as far as a real woman to go. You know what I would it's like to know? Giving the ultimatum. Yeah. And and then seeing it happen versus not giving the well, giving the ultimatum and you still getting on one knee. Yeah. So they were all to know. This is the thing. This is what I want to know. I want to know if the marriage did happen, 
between a man and a woman and a woman proposed, mm. I want to know how many of their marriages are still going. Because that's the know, real question. I guess that really lets you know, was it an equal situation going in, not a situation or a relationship, however you want to put it. Was it going in equally? We want, we both want this. Yeah. And I guess motherfuckers don't be real enough to say who wanted it more. You know, because I guess where I'm going with it is like, if you're a king, if you're a queen, you play your role. You know what I'm saying? So you're not going to pretty much outshine the other if y'all shine better together. You get what I'm saying? So I guess in the, in the lamest terms, under that, if you ain't a king or queen, it's like don't throw somebody under the bus. We married, meaning we past tense, whether or not who wanted it more or not. But I guess you could say – it ain't all women who want to be married more than men as much as they do. But just knowing, nigga, going into it together, yeah, we both wanted this, you know, together. Yeah, I mean, I think... It ain't, we ain't trying to do that. But if, you know what I'm saying, you want to speak on to pinpoint who, who wanted it more, that's cool. But at least we do got a lot of people out here that they agreed to, they wanted that. Yeah, wanted, it's a you know, it's a lot that go into like the whole marriage thing. Period. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Like two people who didn't really see a successful marriage might get married very quickly mm-hmm. because they want to do it right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying. Other people who saw bad marriages might not want to get married. Like you don't know if you know this man, mama, like, and they had a horrible divorce when he was a teenager. Mm-hmm. Then you would understand why this nigga don't want to get married. Don't come to me getting down on one knee. Flat out. So yeah. if you a woman out there and you want to propose to your man, don't do it. Yeah. Just keep taking care of that man. Keep being a good woman to him. And it'll come. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Flat out. <laughs>